So I'm just going to strip this down, take the coil out of it. I already took the part of these wires for the switch, the alert module and the uh, oil level sensor. I took the cover off for the uh, air filter. So just carrying on with that. I'll work this cover off next. And the pull cord. Just pulled that spring off there. I'll have to fit that back for forget. Right, so we're into the coil now. It's there. So just gonna make a bit of room so we can get the cable out. Okay. So obviously there's an air gap between here, you got to reset that when you refit it. So I'll just show you how to refit it before I finish this video. I've got this trick off a guy on YouTube, it's pretty good. Just get a piece of paper, fold it four times. That's zeroed, so when you measure it, it is roughly 0 0.40, so that is dead on, plus, plus or minus 0 0.02, I think. So just pull it up, put your paper under. And push it so it just about touches the paper and do it up. Then you want to check it with your feeler gauge. So I've got a feeler gauge here set to 0.4. It's just touching it nice. So pretty much happy with that. It's a good trick. So I'm just going to take this off now and do some tests on it. But first, before you start your engine up, you might want to turn it over, make sure you ain't hitting nothing, just to be safe. Obviously with the spark plug off, you don't want it starting up. So that's it, I'll just carry on getting this out. Take the cable off it. Okay, that's off. 